What it do, what it do, what it do, my beautiful nieces, divine feminine, beautiful butterflies, and my nephews, divine masculine. If you up in here, it ain't a lot of divine masculines. I don't see a lot of divine masculines. I don't see a lot of masculine energies up in here. If you're masculine energy and you're not divine, or if it's just your first time, represent. How many men is in here watching this read? Um, divine feminine. <laughs> <clears throat> this is a, a, a shake in my head kind of read when I'm picking up here. I I I call these a couple decks that I got. You know, they kind of they're very um, some of them have hurtful things in them, triggering things in these cards. And I've only had these cards about a couple months, if that long. And um, some of them, I, some of the words I haven't, I haven't even seen all the, the words in the decks. Okay, and there, some of them are devastating words. Some of them are very, very triggering. Okay, now what I'm taking these decks as, the decks that are for me to use. To show you the energy that could be coming towards some of you feminines and you may be unaware of it. Okay. It it shows, it tells me things about being kidnapped, um, buried alive. And I mean, um, you know, it, it, it has some harsh stuff, crime scene stuff, and, you know, um, things where I don't even like to read it, but um spirit told me to 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 read to read the cards as a warning so i sat here and i i, I dealt the cards out and i'm gonna start doing this more often because i sit here and i'll shuffle the cards and i'll let them flip out right and Sometimes they don't make sense and I still will go on and do the readings because it's what they wanted to be seen. But now, now I know when they fall out, instead of taking them as they fall out, I put them in the order where they make sense. Okay. Now, it's somebody, Divine Feminine, it's somebody that that somebody is is somebody you're you're falling for somebody and I know I I know I I know now auntie gotta tell you the truth y'all don't get mad at me on what I'm gonna tell you in this reading now okay I'm gonna tell you because I love you and I don't want to see you getting hurt okay it's somebody, um, you're, I feel like you're really into this person, okay? You may even love this person, be in love with this person, hold this person in high regards. But it's somebody out there. They're gonna there it's it's an energy that's gonna get a divine feminine to go to a hotel or a motel. They may even go to the extreme to get a nice motel, a nice hotel, rent a right nice room or something, right? But he's planning on recording. Or you may go to an Airbnb and the, the owners may have some sort of cameras hidden somewhere so this is something that spirit is telling me to make you aware of if you're going to a room a hotel a suite and 
having tantric sex. This is somebody, so it could be you and your person could go to a, a Airbnb or to a hotel or something and somebody could have recorded it. Somebody could be recording you having sex. They don't want to hear. They just want to see. Wow. Now, the overall energy that I pick up is a masculine energy. This is a low down motherfucker. He's 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 the emperor in reverse. The king of wands in reverse. And the world It's going to be the world is all about unity. A joyous accomplishment. Embrace your accomplishments. Right? With the world. So, it will be something joyous for this masculine to get you on camera. Having sex with him doing him and he recorded and show it to people to his friends or he could have put it on the dark web or something or on some porn site site and and you could find out that he he has a website he may take you to this room and then you may find out you on the website and it's going to show you and different other women at that same place where he done made like a uh what is it called a series of the shit yeah i don't know who this is for and this is somebody who you really care about i think tantric sex is emotionally you know entwining sexually And either, either somebody, either your person or a karmic energy, if this is a karmic energy that you're with, he's, he's going to record some shit. Or some of you, this could have happened in the past. Somebody could have, you know, recorded you um, doing oral sex or something, but this was somebody who you was in love with. Let me tell you, if if my ex ever did something like that, and went and, and tried to record it and it was an intimate moment between me and him and he chose to go and, and take it to try to make me feel you know that's called revenge porn this is what this is okay but if you know you loved in your heart that you love that person and you did what you do to make them to give them pleasure, to make them, you know, doing your part. And they take that and they run with it and they do something like the revenge porn. You don't have no reason to be walking around with your head down, sad, worried about what, what people see and what they say. Because in reality, this was somebody you was in a relationship with. You wasn't, you wasn't out just sucking anybody's dick. This is somebody you was in a relationship long term. It could be your ex, whoever. Your ex, you was in long term. It wasn't nobody that you just met and you, you know, it's not like that. Okay? This is what I'm feeling. Some, some revenge porn. But this person is a player and you really cared about them. So we're going to get a little more deeper. Find out. So, okay. Holy Spirit, we got the energy of revenge porn out here. What's going on with the revenge porn when it comes to divine feminine? Three of Cups in reverse. 
the King of Cups in reverse. See? Three of Cups plus the, the, the King of Cups. That's that's somebody all in their feelings. Okay. He's all in his feelings because either um he wanted you to be a third party and you ended it, or he ended it with a third party or something. Something ended with the third party. So He could be trying to do some revenge porn because you broke up with him. You released him, yeah. You released him. So, yeah. So, if somebody has did this to you, don't feel bad. If this is your ex, you don't feel bad about that. You shouldn't. That's just a way for them to, to try to make you feel bad. But you shouldn't feel bad. If that was your man and you were sucking his dick, well, damn. He ate your pussy, well, damn. You didn't video him, but damn, it is what it is. You did it him, he did you. And if anybody came and say something, be like, well, damn, that's my man. I please my man. God damn, what's wrong with that? If anything, it may backfire on him, and you may have did it so good that you may start getting comments on him, and he may go want you back. <laughs> yeah. So, tell me more. Yes, yeah, so this is some revenge porn. But why? Why are they why are they getting revenge? Why are they getting revenge? Why do they want revenge on the divine feminine? Why do they want revenge? Because they're rebellious and they're hothead. They made they made an impulsive decision to do this shit. Ooh, they gonna have regrets. I just hear it. They're hot tempered, impulsive. So this somebody was mad about something and just did it quickly. Cause he mad. He gonna put you put a put a picture or a video of you doing something here. Probably showing your face and all that again. Don't don't even don't even. Somebody come telling me something that my ex did that, I'd be like, um, he did, oh, did he also tell you how his eyes was rolling in the back of his head? <laughs> All these cards fell. Oh, shit, some fell up. Wait a minute. Wow, all of these fell. These fell face up. These fell face down. But see, there's still that broken heart. So I'm going to still put them right there. And look what's on top. Didn't I just say he going to have regrets? They going to have regrets if they do some revenge porn on you. Because it may just get you some attention. And you, you, you nonchalant about it. Because you should be. If you're a divine feminine and somebody's trying to put you, you they know a divine feminine ain't just going around sucking dick for dick sucking sake. No, you were showing love. You make love to your person. And they try to film that and video it. You know, that's revenge porn. And he's having regrets. The five of cups. Yep. Four of wands in reverse. He mad because you won't get back with him. <laughs> and he see you living life life healing sunlight your chakras are balanced yeah and he wanted he wanted to be possessive of you he wanted to control your money and your finances too but his plans didn't work <laughs> Damn. oh yeah so he's so what up what's this over here now he's broken hearted King of Pentacles energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn is going through inner turmoil with the devil out here. He's broken hearted. 
um, because you you release the stress, you let them go. Yeah, so this is what this he's doing. That's crazy. So, ladies, if this is somebody that you and him recently broke up, and he's telling you he wants you to do this, or can it be the old way? Somebody is planning on recording somebody. I don't know who you are. I don't know. Um, hell, they could be just as slick. You say, well, I'll invite them to my house. You know they make cameras like that look like this. You know that they make cameras like these little in you know, glasses. These could be cameras. I'm 58, but I know that. I'm a grandma, and I know that. Yeah. See, this is this is a King of Cups in reverse. He's somebody. He's he he will em emotionally manipulate you. And 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 it's gonna be like. If you're a divine feminine and if somebody is planning this to planning to do this to you, they know that you're very nurturing. You're very compassionate. You're very passionate. You probably <laughs> I, I I get to talking about myself, how nurturing I am. I don't fuck. I don't fuck. I don't have sex. I make love. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. I feel you on that. Yeah. This is somebody, if they record, if they're sneaking and recording, and if they know you're very loving and compassionate and you love all on them, you kiss all on them, and you're just very sexual with them, in that Queen of Wands energy and the, the, the Queen of Cups and you got money and you got your shit going on. You know, you're you're you're, you're driving a nice truck, nice new car, truck, whatever. Your home is in place, tacked, everything is intact. You know what I mean, Divine Feminine, you got it. And it's like because you're not with him. He wants to destroy you by revenge porn. That's so fucked up, but he gonna have regrets. Let's see. What's let's let's get another deck. So we gon' we ain't gon' since he gonna try to do that divine feminine, we ain't gonna get no slutty cards out here. Since he try to put you in a um a situation like that. Transformation, inspiration. <laughs> Damn. See, this this his revenge porn. If he put it out, it's going to backfire. He going to regret that. Because this, this card is talking about transformation, inspiration. He, he may show what you can do sexually. It may inspire some others. It may get to the point to where they start asking him more questions since he didn't put it out there like that. And now he can't get to the main source. Maybe your video got the most most views or something. <laughs> wow. He gonna regret that. 
Some of you may even have a platform. And you're trying to do this to break your character. They're going to be like, shit. Yeah, that's the divine feminine. She got that divine shit. Yeah. Yeah. Only, only that mouth is blessed by God. <laughs> her mouth is truly blessed by the most high. Yes, her mouth is blessed. What's between her legs is blessed too. Yeah, she's blessed. She's divine. He didn't he didn't show you to everybody. But he gonna regret that. See how she's look. Okay, she she's she got some she's let me see if she she's she's naked. And they see you as a you may have showed this person, you know, pictures like this. You could have a beautiful body. You could have put on something in a cat suit or something. You know, he could have took took your pictures and doing some shit and you don't know. Okay, you could have some beautiful, sexy pictures that you sent to him. And he's gathering all them motherfuckers. He probably getting paid off of your beauty, Divine Family. Damn. Oh, Lord. Mm, mm. Whose masculine energy is this? I hope this ain't none of y'all energy. This ain't none of y'all. This is some. We know this. We know we deal with karmics, but uh, I ain't. I, well, like I said, I ain't used all of these cards before, but I've never pulled the energy of revenge card. This is my first time. Yeah, some sort of initiation. He he. Did he take your picture to get himself initiated in some shit? Okay, if this masculine did some revenge porn on Divine Feminine, hmm, Artemis, I don't know what that means, but it's like either that or see how this feminine holding this bow and arrow, that could mean somebody is, is, they targeted you, Divine Feminine, or the roles can be reversed, and this could be a feminine energy who could have got some of, something out of your person's phone. She could, you know, this masculine, he may not be tech savvy, and she could have went in his porn, in his phone, and put your pictures, like, on porn of you and him, something, yeah. Revenge porn. See? Yeah, you probably you probably sent this masculine. See how she's she's naked and she's naked? Somebody could be jealous of your body. They could be fat and you could be like this. And you could have sent this masculine some pictures with something. You could have had little clothes on, but it could have been some fishnet type of something. And and she took these pictures, but it, if if whoever whoever sent them or did them, the the backfire is they was people didn't see it, see you as ratchet or raunchy. They didn't see you as that. Nope, that's why it backfired. If anything, they they probably calling you something goddess on there or something divine feminine. Yeah. And that's, look, didn't I just say a goddess? The dragonfly goddess. You may have made something, um, you, you're wearing something with, with some wings on it or something that goes under the arms, like wings. All of these are, are showing stuff like that, okay? This one, she could be, you know, they could be saying you a witch, And you're casting spells and stuff. So they they tried to do some revenge porn. Or, oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. Um, somebody put your, your pictures out there. Revenge porn. Because she's saying that you didn't put you didn't did something to her. What does she think that divine feminine did to her? She's a part of the occult. Okay? Some secrets came out as I picked this up. She's a part of the occult. She's she's saying that you're a part of the occult. That you're in the secret 
like in, in some secret satanic shit. She wants you to be struggling, but you at the Nine of Pentacles. So, this person, she, you know, she, if, if it's a feminine energy who, who got a hold of your person's phone or something, if this resonates with you, or they don't even have to have a, 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 a video of you, they can, you know, put pictures of you, get your picture off of social media and put your picture, put your face to somebody else's body. Okay. This is some shit that's going on out here. Somebody wants you to be stressed out and burnt out, like to make you look that burnt out if you're on a, a porn side or something. But you ain't burnt out, Divine Feminine. Mm -mm. She need to get her fucking wig tightened up because that motherfucker is lopsided. Whoever the fuck she is, her wig is twisted or uh, her glued and loosened up or something. She ain't got no fucking edges. She could be some high yellow female with a twisted wig. Always walking around in some yellow um, like dress and ain't got no panties up under it and probably stinking and shit. She don't wear panties. Mm. I hope that ain't you, Divine Feminine. You ain't stinking. You probably walking around with something yellow with no panties on. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody is. I said the stinky part because the karmics, they be stinking. Not all of them be stinking, but you know, like them them funky karmics that they just got real dark demonic spirits. They stink. They done laid around and I'm talking about them whole, them whole karmics. Now, the karmic energies that got a lot of money, they they, they take care of themselves. They still are karmic because they do low vibrational shit, but they ain't, not all of them is out there hoeing and sleeping, okay? It's different karmic energies, yeah. This is a stank hoe. That didn't try to, she didn't put you on the, she probably put you on the same porn as her, and you probably got more views than her. She mad. Damn. Yeah, whatever she did, whatever try to pour, in, whatever she tried to do to to make you look bad, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't turn out the way she wanted it to. Yeah, and like I said, she don't actually have to have a video of you. Some of you, she could get your picture, some sort of way. Like you never know who knows who. Some of you could be at your job. Somebody could have your photo ID at your job and get a picture of your, your photo ID. Get your picture off your, your driver's license. You know, people know place, people in other places that you may be unaware of. So somebody could have got your picture off of your driver's license. <laughs> you smile at this shit and they put you on the board. Damn. Wow. Ooh. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's, let's, let's see. Yeah, so if they did, if they did, you know, okay, if she did try to do some some sort of revenge porn, the way this feminine energy is dressed right now, this this is how you, you know, this how you represent yourself, like a queen, like a goddess. But she wanted to present you to the world as somebody slutty, low vibration. But even if you, even if you, if you was dressed slutty for your man, you was dressed slutty for your man. You feel me? You was, you was fulfilling whatever he asked you to do. Okay. Yeah. So I guess that's it. And, um. If this reading resonated with you, I hope it didn't. It ain't going to resonate with you. It ain't going to resonate with you. But if you like this story of, of whoever karmic this energy is, put it, in the, put it in the comments or talk about it. We can talk about it. And um, I do want to do a live, you guys. 
I just need everybody to tune in. And, and it ain't going to be no particular topic. I'm going to just go live and then just sit there and wait. If you want a question for me to answer a question with my my um pendulum, I'll be answering yes and no questions for free. Okay? So, just something to kill time. But um, if this reading um, got your attention, if it struck a nerve with you, if it triggered you, hit that thumbs up button for me. Okay. If it gave you some information in your situation or clarification in your situation, hit that thumbs up for me. And share it. Okay. See you. Peace out.